Since I got you, you stole my heart away with the things that you do. And lately, you drive me crazy, baby. Maybe that's why I escape in your love. There's no place. Good morning, good afternoon. Good morning, LSD. It's so loud in here. This is what we're talking about when we say like our car's too loud to film in. Like, I don't know if you guys can hear me clearly because I have a screen. You guys are probably wondering why I look this bad. What are you talking about? And if you're not wondering, you don't look bad at all. I'm running off of like three hours of sleep. I'm so exhausted, but I can't sleep. It's like my life, the worst feeling ever. It's, it's a recent thing though. Like yes. the last like three nights. No, the last like week I have not been able to go. I've not been able to sleep. I'm running off of three hours of sleep and a 10 minute nap. And that 10 minute nap made us late to our appointment. How did I wake up at 5 a.m.? And we're still late to our appointment. That's what I would like to know. It's because of your 10 minute nap. Because he wasn't even up when I took my 10 minute nap. So let's be clear. It's because you weren't up. <sighs> Today. Oh my gosh. It's so rugged in here. We need a mom, a mom mobile ASAP. Mom car needs to come sooner than later because this is crazy. So we're going to my ultrasound appointment. I feel like I haven't been in so long, it feels like. And um, if you guys don't know, I am, or we are officially halfway through this freaking pregnancy. It's kind of bittersweet. It's, I feel like it's kind of going by fast, but it's kind of going by slow. Isn't that what I mean? So I'm 20 weeks today, and um, <laughs> it's so bumpy, it's like hard to keep it still. So yeah, and it's still unreal. It feels like I'm really growing a human. Like, it's kind of scary, but it's so exciting. It's just like, I just can't fathom it yet. Like, it doesn't feel like real yet, but it does feel, I do feel way more kicking now. Ever since, ever since I felt that first kick, literally, I've almost peed on myself like five times due to being like kicked or something in the water and very active definitely but it makes me feel good it makes me feel like I'm not alone so we are late hopefully we can this is so loud alright guys we just got in the exam room how are you feeling babe? I have been here so long I know you get annoyed because you feel like you should be seeing our doctor more and we did ask to get in trouble just for filming this. That's the thing that sucks. They don't really let you, they don't let you get the experience of having it's a. It's my experience. Like it's my baby. I kind of film my own experience with my own baby. After we get out of this exam room, I'm sure it's gonna go straight to the ultrasound. So I'm gonna try to film that if I can. So that's, that's what's going on. Can you read the five months right there? Your baby <laughs> will know. Got um, LASIK now. I got 20, 20 inches, inches long. And Your baby about will. Your baby will know 10 inches long. Like, your I know you're will now be. Your what will be? Your baby will now be something 10 inches long and weigh about one and a half pounds. Okay? No. You will begin to. No, it's not what it said. What are you saying? Baby, your baby will you now need, be you oh, need, 8 to 10 inches long. You just went away. You what? need LASIK. No, I don't need LASIK. Oh my gosh, let's go back to Dr. Boxer. I'm not ever getting LASIK. I'm not ever getting no, no type of No, if you were, had my oh, vision, no, no, you're no, going no, back to no LASIK. Search. Back to LASIK. My eyes are good. <laughs> not, not that good though. My eyes are fantastic. When is the doctor going to come? I'm hungry. Hey, let's gang. We got fantastic, like, just made my day type of news. But I'll talk to you about it in a second. We have like an hour break before her ultrasound. So we had to get something to eat because we haven't eaten yet. All right, lunch. You guys have seen this in our vlog at least 10 times. We used to live right down the street and a side of fries. And that's where me and Landon used to work. So we used to walk over there, go to Flukies, and get a grilled chicken salad. So I wish I could film like this. You guys could see my food. Oh my God, eat a cucumber. So while uh, we literally have to rush to eat because it took way longer than we freaking thought for a salad. But the good news that we wanted to share
got our results back because like you have, at a certain point during the pregnancy you have testing for like a lot of things that could be wrong obviously with the baby this is to make sure that your baby's fit to be healthy so in particular it's what they did down, down syndrome, syndrome that like a thing where like there's a split in the spine or something yeah, or fluid like, in the spine not, or something it's like, like the spine's like open or something like that and then yeah. something with a bad like enzyme as well yeah so it's like things that are just like obviously you're determined hoping, to have a sick baby you're right? hoping for a negative you don't want a positive obviously on any of those and um yeah we did a first and a second trimester one and we didn't get the results back for either so we were kind of like nervous nervous but the doctor's like oh well no news is good news but we were just kind of like you just want to hear that like it's okay and so i went in today and i'm like can we please get our results and she was like yeah and she read everything to us so baby right, is right. negative for down syndrome which is like the biggest one there and um it's just really good to know. everything was negative yeah everything was negative it was negative so it was just really exciting so also i shrunk an inch <laughs> i feel like you guys should know that she was five six now she's five look five. doesn't lie and i also got gained a lot of weight don't you guys can't see the weight part. You can only see the five, five right there. That's all you guys can see. Anyways, that made my day. To, made my day. Because You're I was, the healthy baby. I know. I was waiting for that. Like that was a big deal because we were waiting. We didn't get results. Like literally, we had results like two months after we were supposed to get them. And then we have some more big news that we're gonna go find out after we eat our lunch. So. So with this ultrasound we're about to get, this is the 20-week ultrasound, and this is the ultrasound where they give us the gender and. We did our 14 week gender, or 14, we did our 14 week ultrasound, which we, is the one you guys already saw where we got the gender and we gave it to my mom, so that's what my mom knows. So this one is definitely gonna be the one to confirm if it's for sure the right gender, because there's a small chance that they could tell us that it's a different gender. You guys remember that little mix up we had, so this is gonna be the make it or break it one. So, <laughs> it's a higher chance, obviously, that they're gonna tell us the same sex, okay? So this is a big deal for us. I'll wait, like, but like, how are we gonna do? They're giving an envelope. Yeah. What? What if they just say it? No, I'm gonna tell them. Don't say it. But I want to know the gender. But don't say it because I, you got to say that first, though. Because if you say we want to oh know the gender, God, it's, like, a it's, boy, a it's a girl. All right. I'm gonna be like, I'll be so mad. We're just gonna be like, I was gonna. We didn't hear nothing. We don't know. We didn't know anything. No, no I'm telling. I'm saying I know. We gotta. Yeah, no surprise. We gotta be surprised. So we're gonna get the new envelope. Give it to my mom so she can compare. What time is it? What? Gotta go so she could compare and hopefully it's the same. I'm telling you. So we're gonna finish eating and get back to the hospital. Guys. Mama McBroom doesn't get the envelope today. Yes. Alright guys, so we just got out of our ultrasound. We found out a lot of information. We saw a lot of cool things. We have no, stop. Wait, no, no, stop. No. On the okay, I'm not gonna. I'd let me just hold it. No, you're so thirsty. Show them the envelope. And then and then hold, hold the hold ultrasound. Hold no. Look, I'm have, not playing. Babe, I'm not playing. Look, I'm not playing. So I'm not gonna do anything. The, the gender is in this envelope. Have the gender, so this will clear up all of our. No. Why would you crunch it? I'm not stupid. There's a freaking ultrasound in there. So look, the gender of our baby is in this thing. And I'm not gonna let her ever. I wouldn't open it. We're too close. Like I wouldn't ruin it. Yeah, really? We're too close. Really? Because you asked about it 80 times from look, over there. Look, you can see his hand. Hey. <laughs> That's crazy. You see it? All right, we are back home now, guys. And I'm just so excited. I'm so happy. I'm so grateful, most importantly. Um, thank you, God, that literally Everything's everything good. is great. Baby is exceptional, healthy, active. And they do not like ultrasounds because they were kicking my bladder the whole time. But um, we're so happy. We're so excited. Now we have some calls today. Yes. So like I said, guys, this is what we're waiting Don't on. Don't put the teeth through. They could like see it. <laughs> I'm so nervous. If I can't know, Ellis gang, you guys can't know because you know. So this is what we're waiting on. <laughs> so now I gotta call my mother because she has to, this has to be in her hands as soon as possible. Hello? Hello, mother. Hello, Landon. So we got some good news for you. What's that? So we did our 20 week ultrasound today, which is the one where it tells us the gender, right? Oh no, you guys didn't look, did you? No, more importantly, the 20 week one was to determine all the tests and abnormal and rule out all like the abnormalities. So if everything's great with that, let's start off with that. Everything's great. We have a perfectly healthy baby. And that first envelope that you got that you would not let me touch. We have a second envelope that Landon is not letting me touch. And we 
We need you to be the only one who touches them. So this needs to get into your hands as soon as possible so that you can make sure that they're the same. Okay, when are you bringing it to me? Um, when can we? Tonight. Okay, we might be able to do that tonight. Okay. So, you know, also, that's obviously good news. You know our gender reveal is literally less than two weeks away now. Yes, I do know. It's a very big deal and it's it came fast. Okay. So, is that everything is good to go? Everything is ready? Everything's done? Uh, we're finalizing the food, but yeah, we're good to go. Okay, okay. Yeah, so excited. So, the real question is, because we never really talked about it, we never really talked to the LS gang about it, who's really the one making the magic happen? Who's really doing this? Well, it's a compilation of multiple people here. Okay. So, of course, me as the lead, right? <laughs> okay, you as the lead. So it's a family effort. Yes, yeah, they're really contributing. Well, everyone's coming together to make this happen is what you're saying. Yes. This is like the next really big thing that they're waiting for. And you know, we're, we're, we're gonna do a whole production and really make it something for them to see. Who, the LS gang? The LS gang, yes. We're so excited. So, well, they, won't, they won't be let down, so. Okay, all right, Mama. Well, I love you. We'll see you, we'll possibly see you tonight. We'll call you later. Okay, I love you. Okay, no, I need it. Shyla cannot be trusted. I, she cannot I'm, be trusted. I'm responsible. I, I, I agree. Okay, so I need them. It's not see-through. Okay, I love you. I love you, bye. Bye. The anticipation's killing me, man. Okay, so shout out to everyone that has made our gender reveal possible. Like, shout out to our family, everyone taking like their time, their effort to really like make this day special for us. This is gonna be like the biggest, like for sure the best day of our lives, ever. When it, yeah, well. Well, I mean, are you telling me that? <laughs> As of right now. It's gonna be the biggest event. It's gonna be the have. next best thing in our lives. For sure. For right now, you know, and then 100%. birth, like we're so freaking excited. Okay, let me see. No. So, you were gonna, you're, I'm so you're gonna drive all the way to Malibu? Possibly, as long as I know it's out of your, like, you know where it's at, it's out of like, you know. I'll drive, because it'll risk. give me time to right meditate. Now, right, now it's, right now it's at risk. It's not at risk. I, it is. Right you, you risk. left it in the kitchen with me when you went upstairs. Because you said, I, you said, you're being so annoying, I promise I'm not gonna freaking look at it. I didn't even look at the Come on, thing. dude. I didn't even look at it. That's what, come on. Like, you know you're so antsy right now, you're itching. You're literally itching. What my baby says is, talk to the hand. Look at the little finger. Oh, you think it has my fingers? We both got long fingers. You got them long jumps. So since our family has pretty much covered everything else for our gender reveal, we just have to stress on what to wear. I'm currently trying to find an outfit, but like, I already got my shoes. You guys wanna see these? <laughs> these are the nicest shoes I, okay wait, just keep it on me. These are the nicest shoes I own, and like, they make me feel like a princess. Okay, ready guys. Wow, they just saw all the way. <laughs> Because if you guys know me, you know I love glitter. And like, I just want it to feel like a princess. Like, I want the day to be like a wedding. So, I don't have an outfit, but I have shoes. And that's the most important part. You love them? I like them. I think they're gonna look you really good them? on you. I mean, you already, I've already seen you in them. You love them? I love them. I love you. All right, guys, as always, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Our gender reveal is getting closer, less than two weeks. We love you guys so much. Peace.